right? Which is called the willpower, the ability to envision a better world, a, a, a better solution. It, 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 it's something that, that, that can overcome any challenge or difficulty that faces us, you know? That's what we'll say the leverage that man has. It's not his body, it's not his fastness. You know, anything you can tell, tell about a human being, you can find one animal that will beat the, will beat the human being, right? The lion is bigger than a normal human being, right? The tiger is even more bigger, much bigger than a normal human being. So we're not better than animals for size, right? We cannot camouflage, right? We, 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 so how do we then lord it over these animals? Because we're higher than them. The only thing that gives us leverage, whereby we're able to stay in a place of kingship, in a place of reigning in life, is our brain, our ability to think. That is what gives us leverage in this life. So when in Genesis 1.28, it says that we should have dominion, what he gave to us to have dominion with is our ability to think, our ability to create, our ability to envision, our ability to imagine. Because whatever we imagine, we can bring into existence. So irrespective of what challenge faces us today, all it takes for us to be able to imagine the solution. Because once we can imagine it, we can bring it into, into life. Right, that's a leverage God has given to us, and unfortunately, those that should know better have been the ones doing the job of the devil, the church. But we have been the ones doing the work of a devil by limiting people, by using witchcraft on our own people. Why? Because those at the top want to lord it over those that are below. They are seemingly doing what Jesus Christ says he hates. He hates a loaded top. He says that the way to be great in the kingdom is to serve. When we serve, then we're not scared of position. We're not scared of other people overtaking us, right? But because we are scared, we, we, we become Jeroboam. We take on the Jeroboam spirit. Instead of taking on the Davidic spirit, we take on the Jeroboam spirit. Jeroboam, God gave him 10 kingdoms overnight. God gave him 10 kingdoms, but he could not believe that God that gave him 10 kingdoms can keep those 10 kingdoms for him. So he worked out a solution outside of God to maintain those 10, those 10 tribes. That same thing we find in church. God has blessed us, given us anointing, given us position, we now begin to look for ways to seemingly guarantee that position outside of God. You know, God help us. Let's pray.